Good morning, everybody. I'm Triclade, and this is a new format that I'm trying out. I have a camera now. So Evo happened, and some new exciting news for Tekken were announced. A little bit vague, but a new balance patch and a small teaser for what could potentially be the next Tekken game? Question mark? Not sure. So we're gonna actually take a moment to look at the uh, announcements one more time and just talk about them. Just for fun, trying out something new, at least uh, with this new recording setup. So let's take a look at them. So alongside the uh, Tekken World Tour that started a few months back in uh, CEO, during this EVO, they had announced uh, a new balance patch, which was kind of unexpected. Because the last balance patch that we got was pretty much, what was it, like a year ago? Something like that. So basically what we saw there was uh, more counter hit properties mostly. Uh, some natural launchers, what it seems like, primarily focusing on strengthening the weaker characters. Now, this new tactic section focuses on a new type of wall stun mechanic. What would normally be a wall splat, they hit the wall and they kind of slump over. Some speculate that it's gonna result in some guaranteed damage. However, to me, it looks like you wall stun them and then uh, you are forced into a mix-up. I'm not sure how how it really is going to work, because as we saw from all of the clips that we're seeing, it was from multiple types of moves that they had different properties on hit. Ballerina spins, pushback, and uh, just regular knockdowns. We have a clip here of Steve, my main character. That move right there, it would have normally been a knockdown move that would have, depending on the angle, guaranteed a forward 1 plus 2 2. But in this case, it looks like you were put into a mix up where he does the uh, down back 3 2 right there. It seems like it could be an interesting mechanic. His uh, peekaboo down forward 1 2 performs a wall stun now. I'm just curious what his rocket launcher quadricycle forward 1 will perform. Will that also perform a wall stun? Or is it uh, gonna be the same as usual wall splat into what we're used to, basically? So it's gonna be interesting to see what type of moves. That would be crazy if wall splat wouldn't even exist anymore. That it has been completely changed to a wall stun into mix-up. Completely new meta. I'm curious to see what it's gonna be. This is cool. The Global Finals are back in Amsterdam. I believe they were there last time as well. However, we have a date for it, which is in February. And uh, that pretty much means that is the time we're going to get more Tekken news. Just a side note, this is a very well edited video. I really like this highlight reel. And that right there. I would like to point out that the update is free. Yay! <laughs> I mean, balance patches usually are free. It's, it's good to have that confirmed that it is free. But then we got to a pretty exciting moment. Tekken 1, okay. Classic cutscene. Why are, why are you showing this? Pretty much my thought process. Watching it live. Oh. Get ready. When I saw this live, I lost my shit. However, unfortunately, that's all we got. So what can we get from this? A lot of people started speculating, is this going to be a remake of the original or like the old games? And to me, that was like, why, why, why would they do that? That seems a little bit odd. Considering that 
we had an announcer that says, get ready. Kind of like, get ready for the next battle. All the signs are pointing to a new Tekken game. But this is just a teaser. After a long, long time of no info whatsoever from the developers, the Tekken community is kind of divided on this. Like, we could have gotten a lot more than just this little teaser. However, I am uh, happy that we at least got this. Definitely seems like a new Tekken game is in the works. We are probably going to get more information about this uh, during the Game Awards that is going to take place in December. However, if not, we have the Tekken World Tour Finals uh, during February. Until then, all we can really do is just wait and get ready, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Was this enough of an announcement? I think so. Of course, I would have loved more. But yeah, I'm looking forward to what's going to be announced in the near future. So those are my thoughts on this thing. Thank you for watching. Bye.